that wall is pushed against the soil mass. If this wall is pushed against the soil mass, it means this is the passive stage. And if that passive stage is there, soil is cohesive, passive earth pressure has been asked. In this case, if we consider that Kp, so that Kp will be equivalent to 1 plus sin phi upon 1 minus sin phi. That sin phi, phi is given that is 15 degree, so that is sin 15 divided by 1 minus sin 15 degree that is equivalent to 1.7. So, that Kp is 1.7. First of all, we will calculate that sigma v at any particular depth that is suppose for example, z. So, at the depth of z, if we consider that sigma v, so that sigma v will be equivalent to q plus gamma into z. That soil is cohesive and in cohesive case that passive earth pressure is small pp will be equivalent to kp into sigma v plus 2c root kp. It means you can say that this sigma v is equivalent to q plus gamma z, so kpq plus kp into gamma into z plus 2c root kp. Soil is in passive stage and soil is cohesive. So, actually there are like 3 terms, 3 parameters. In this case that pp you can say is equivalent to kp into q and this q is equivalent to 60 plus kp into gamma that gamma is 20, 20 kilo Newton per meter cube into may z plus 2 into 36 into root 1.7. So, in this case 3 expression are there kp, q, kp gamma z and 2c root kp. If we draw these diagrams, so this kp q is this kp is 1.7 and q is equivalent to 60. So, this value is equivalent to 102. Next one is this triangle k into gamma into z. So, that top z is equal to 0, this value will be 0 and at the base this is equivalent to k into gamma into h and this is equivalent to 270. Next one k these 2 k q and k gamma z is positive that is compressive in nature, but this 2 c root k p is also in compressive nature and that is plus and this value is equivalent to 2 c root k p and this 2 c root k p is equivalent to 93.88. So, actually there are 2 rectangulars and 1 triangle. So, you can say okay, that total earth pressure or capital P p will be equivalent to P p 1 plus P p 2 plus P p 3. P p 1 is rectangle. So, you can say base into height and that area is equivalent to 102 into height that is equivalent to 8 plus P p 2 is triangle. So, that is half into base into height that is 272 into 8 and that third one is rectangle base into height that is 93.8 into 8. So, that final answer will be 2655 kilo Newton per meter because we are considering that unit length of this wall. So, final answer is 2655 kilonewton per meter.